Why do dogs bite and how do they warn us? Dog aggression is a very complex topic, but in the dog's mind, its reason for biting may be quite simple. If it bites when its resources, food, its position on the furniture or a toy are threatened, it feels entitled to punish the owner for encroaching on its territory. The number of people who would believe that there is a generation of dogs intent on biting people for fun is quite alarming. Why do dogs bite? Well, let's be clear on one thing. Dogs can and do bite. Their mouths are their first line of defense and attack. When dogs do bite, the consequences range from shock, minor injuries all the way to fatalities. Dog bites are in fact avoidable. A better understanding of a dog's body language can help us get somewhere near to understanding the reasons and motivations for its biting and serious attacks. Why does the lizard's tail grow back? Lizards have tails which they can cut down themselves to keep safe from predators. Such process is called autonomy and later such cut tails can grow too. When a lizard's tail is cut, you can never see its bleeding because the blood vessel automatically minimizes and stops bleeding. On being cut, a lizard's tail wriggles around the floor. It seems that it will be generated again. So there is no loss to the lizard. But in actual, a lizard keeps its fat stored in its tail. So the loss of the tail can cause a lizard to feel deficiency. A new tail takes around 9 weeks to generate. In the beginning, you can see just a dark stump of limb vessels. Sometimes the tail does not cut down completely. Later it heals. In such a situation, a lizard can have 2 or 3 tails. Lizards are able to grow new tails for them through limb generation. Why do we blink our eyes? Eyelid which blinks is one of the involuntary movements in the human body. The action of blinking essentially keeps the eye moist and protects it from any foreign matter. The fold of skin which forms the eyelid also has sebaceous glands underneath it which secrete oils to keep our eyes away from drying. The rapid action of these muscles does not interfere with our vision or sight. The eyelid also sucks the tear from the gland in the eye so that it may keep the eye moisturized all through the day. The eyelashes on the other hand act as a dust catcher and stop any particle to enter the eye and irritate. The camel also has long eyelashes which shield it from the dust or sandstorm in the desert. A perfect example of how the animal and human body have evolved. Blinking is a mechanism to shield, moisturize and keep the eye out of drying and therefore is vital for the health of the human eye. Why do we dream? Dream is what we experience, see and feel during sleep. But why is it caused? Whether it has some purpose or not is not fully answered by anyone yet. At present, there are two groups who explain the answer to such questions as per their own perspective. But in some points, both are the same as dreaming takes place during REM or rapid eye movement, sleeping phase, etc. In 1977, J. Allen Hobson and Robert McCarley gave the activation synthesis model of dreaming. Accordingly, during REM sleep, our brain gets activated and causes the areas of limbic system, amygdala and hippocampus involved in emotions, memories, sensations, etc., which result in dreaming. Finally, our brain synthesizes and interprets this internal activity in signals. As for Hobson, dreams are never meaningless, but whether it is true or not, no one knows till now. Thanks for watching. Do like, share, subscribe to Sahil Book House.